implement a method to perform basic string compression using the counts of repeated characters. For example, the string AABCCCCAAA would become A2B1C5A3. If the compressed string would not become smaller than the original string, your method should return the original string. So essentially we are replacing repeated characters with the count of that character. Here's our compressed method. It takes in a string. If the string is null or empty, we simply return the original string. We create an instance of the string builder class to store the characters of our new string. We initialize the previous character to the first character of our string. We initialize the count of the character to 1. We loop through the string from 1 to the length of the string. We do not start at 0 because we already stored the first character of the string in the previous character variable. If the character at the current index is equal to the previous character, we need to increment the count. Otherwise, if the current character is not equal to the previous character, we must set that character alongside that character's count. Then we set the current character to be the new previous character we will check on the next iteration. We must also reset our count to 1, because now we are looking at a new character. Since we are always setting the previous character in the loop, we must add the final character and its count after the final iteration. Now that all characters have been added to the string builder, we call toString to get our result string. If our compressed string is the same length or longer than the original string, then we just return the original string. Otherwise, we return the compressed string. So let's run our compressed method with some example data. As you can see, when we compressed null, it returned null. When we compressed the empty string, it returned the empty string. When we compressed two A's, two B's, and two C's, it returned two A's, two B's, and two C's because it was the same length as it would be compressed. When we compressed two A's, two B's, and three C's, it returned A2, B2, C3, the compressed string, because the compressed string is shorter than the string that was sent in. And here's the string from the question. It returns A2, B1, C5, A3 as expected.